Hey guys, Kurt Slosser with GeekWire. Last time we were down here, Bertha was breaking through that wall right there and finishing her work on the Seattle Tunnel. Today, GeekWire is getting a tour from end to end of this project that is realigning the waterfront highway beneath the city. And we're seeing the work that's being done to complete the double-decker road that will take cars from near the Space Needle all the way down to the stadiums, a two-mile journey. You know, if you've, ever, uh, if you've ever gone on a vacation with your buddies, it's maybe called a man trip. Well, that's actually also the name of this vehicle that we're riding in, carrying men and women. And it's used to carry workers, too, from one end of the tunnel to the other. Oh, uh, believe when the tunnel opens in two years, they won't be as shaky as this is. This is really not a very comfortable trip. So I'm standing roughly where the uh, lower roadway will exist. We're a little bit below it, actually. There's a there's a ledge here that that roadway will sit on, and beneath that is a is a maintenance shaft of sorts where utility lines will run and and access to those uh, will be possible. Above me is the where the upper roadway will 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 run, and they're nearly done with that. They're about 90% or more done with the upper roadway as it connects up here near the uh, the north exit. Um, but in this part of the tunnel, what's cool is we can see all those rings that Bertha placed to create the outer wall over the years. So this is the point where the, uh, the rigging has reached the, the, the point for as far along as they are on the upper roadway. Uh, as I said, we're not that far from the end of the tunnel, just several hundred yards. Uh, this, the, the upper portion is actually poured in place. Uh, the concrete is poured. Uh, the lower deck, the, the panels for that roadway are assembled or they're poured off site and then those panels are trucked up from Tacoma and laid into place. And apparently the first one arrived today. So Bertha used to, as Bertha traveled this, this tunnel and dug the hole and laid the rings, the upper roadway was also being poured at the same time. So it's like a, a orchestra of activity behind that giant boring machine. And now that that's cleared out, trucks go back and forth, people, equipment, and soon the lower roadway will fill all this in. So this is the end of the northbound journey. Uh, cars will be coming out of the tunnel on State Route 99. Traffic will split here. Cars will continue north on 99. And there's also an exit here for Dexter Avenue. This part of the tunnel as you can see, is is already got the white walls, the glossy white and gray. Uh, that color scheme will continue throughout the two-mile tunnel all the way down to the south end. Two of the elements of this project are complete, and that's tunneling and the extraction. And now the third element, the interior structure, is well on its way. Today is, is a milestone day as we basically line ourselves up. STP lines themselves up to start the construction and the laying down of the northbound panels that are directly in back of us. And as you guys saw, that southbound upper deck is almost to the northern polar deck. Uh, with the TVM extraction on August 23rd, uh, we uh, continued with the construction at the north portal after the TVM was out of the way. I think you all saw the progress that's been made there in the receiving pit. As Joe said, uh, the interior structures has continued. I think we've done uh, 152 out of 171 pours of the upper deck, or 159 out of 171, so we're over 90% complete with the upper deck. Uh, I think we did our last lower wall pour just the other day. So the interior structures from a cast-in-place concrete standpoint is very close to completion. Well, our schedule right now is to achieve substantial completion by October of next year, which leads to opening the tunnel of traffic in early 2019. 
Uh, the work has gone very well over the last several months. We're on target to hit that date. Um, we're fairly confident that we're going to be able to install this uh, lower deck uh, for the uh, northbound highway as scheduled. We continue to look for ways to uh, improve our performance, shorten the schedule, but we're still uh, looking at something late next year with an opening for traffic early in 2019.